like a brand new theme, a brand new virtue, and a brand new memory version? Yes, yes we, we have we a brand do. new everything. Oh my goodness, I'm wait, so wait, excited. But before we do that, I okay. think we should introduce ourselves. We should. Okay, okay. My name is Christopher. I'm Miss Rachel. And I'm Kaden. And we want to welcome you to the Elementary Weekend Experience. Oh. Okay, so we have some other people we got to welcome too, right? Yeah, we do. Who are they? Our first time guests. First, first time, time guests. guests. Oh, yeah. What should our first time guests drop in the chat? Okay, so I think our first time guests should drop a thumbs up because I think that they should drop a thumbs up because they really like it so much that they want to come over to the elementary weekend experience. I love it. I love it. And for those of you all who this is not your first time, you're coming back again. We want to welcome you, too. What should they drop in the chat? A trophy. A trophy. Let's trophy. go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, so we just said we have a brand new, like, everything. Let's start with our theme. What's our theme for this month? Our theme is ready, set, move. move. Follow Jesus here, here there, there, and, and everywhere. everywhere. Oh, yeah. And our brand new virtue for this month is faith. Faith is trusting in what you can't see because of what you can see. Oh, wow, that's actually kind of cool. I know, I and know. I think with our new month, we also have a new verse. And our verse is... God's grace has saved you because of your faith in Christ. Your salvation doesn't come from anything you do. It is God's gift. Ephesians 2, 8. Man, that is awesome. I can't wait to learn all about that this month. Yeah, I know. It's so exciting. Oh, but, yeah. But I think I hear some, you know, some kind of music. Oh, know, yeah. This is another music, so exciting you know, part. Some kind, of, some kind of praise and worship. Praise and worship. Praise and worship. Praise and worship. Okay, and let's see. Okay, I gotta put 
pick that up for that. Friend. What are you doing? Oh, hey, I'm doing a favor for a friend. Um, d do you have anything you need me to do for you? No, I don't. Are I'm, you Are you sure? I'm positive. I, anything I can help you out with. Why are you trying to help so much? Well, because I just, you know, I just like helping. <laughs> mm, why though? Well, because because well, okay, so okay, so my birthday is coming up. Okay. Right? Oh yeah. Yes, yes, and I want to make sure that I, you know, done enough stuff for my friends so they'll get me a lot of presents. Oh, but you don't have to do stuff. Why not? Because you know there's a better gift. Really? Yeah. You don't have to do anything to earn this certain gift. Oh. Even with your friends. Oh. They just get you gifts because they love you. Oh. You know who else is like that? Who? I have a little story. Okay. About someone who gave us the most ultimate gift. Okay. Okay. And that gift is called salvation. Ooh. All right. So uh, this guy named Paul. Okay. He was um, staying in Ephesus. Mm -hmm. So he was in Ephesus and he uh, talked about the good news and he talked about unity with all his people. But then he ends up getting arrested oh. a couple of years after. He gets what? arrested, but while he's in prison, okay. he's writing letters to his people okay. back in Ephesus. Okay. The people that he spoke the good news to, the people that he fellowship with. He's over there writing a long letter back to them. Uh -huh. And in this letter, you want to know what it said? Yes. It was quite a long letter. Okay. But um, in this letter, basically, Paul was telling the people of Ephesus that... Jesus gave you a free gift. Oh. We're his sons and daughters. Wow. Jesus adopted us, and we didn't have to do anything to earn it. Really? Nope. You don't have to try to clean up or do favors for people. Oh. But God just gave us this gift because he loves us. Oh. Yeah, so he sent his son to die for us because straight love. No, nothing. You don't have to do anything to earn it. Wow. So then how do we accept this gift? If he's just giving it to us, how do we accept it? You take it. It's out of grace. Oh. It's for God's grace. And do you know what grace means? I do not. What does that mean? Grace means that you get something that you don't necessarily deserve. Oh, so we just got to tell God, like, God, thank you for giving me this gift of salvation. And I want to accept it. And you just, you just. Yes. Oh, wow. You tell God, you accept it. He's created us to be his masterpieces. Wow. That's also what the letter said. So, yeah, you don't have to do anything to earn your gift. You don't have to do anything. Okay. Yeah. God wow. just gives it to you freely. And then so when we get the gift of salvation, right? So that means we get to live forever with Jesus, not just in heaven. So yes, when we get to heaven, but also even now, because he gives us a better life here on earth, right? Correct. Heaven on earth is what he calls it. That is awesome. <laughs> well, I get to live with Jesus here and forever in heaven. That is a great gift. I know. It's the best gift I've ever received. <laughs> yes. So wow. Jesus, the, Jesus's salvation is a gift and you don't have to do anything to earn it. Don't do anything. You don't have to do anything anything just accept it and live for jesus yeah isn't that great yes i'm so excited i am too so now you know that you have a free gift at all times i love that there we go Whew, okay i guess i don't have to do any of those yeah flavors. calm down calm okay down. okay okay <laughs> okay <gasps> should we pray i think we should okay everybody put one hand up and put the other hand up and smack them together and say dear god thank you so much for this free gift of salvation that you have given to us thank you that you have given us this gift so that we can live forever in heaven with you but that so we can also have the new amazing life that you have for us here on earth with you with jesus in jesus name amen amen Woo! see you next week friends see ya wow oh that my goodness that story. was such an amazing story i know right yes oh i love it okay and you know my favorite part of the story is always the bottom line so i think the way that we do the bottom line we put our hands fist in the air and we go bottom line bottom line Bottom line! Bottom line! And the bottom line is, what is, it? What is it? Jesus is a gift for everyone. Okay, wow. can you say that again? What is our bottom line? Jesus is a gift for everyone. That is awesome. That is so I amazing. Know, right? it's yes. Crazy amazing. Yes. But you know, I think that they should also.
like, share, and subscribe. So then that way you can stay up to date on all the stories and all the videos that we post. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, yeah. I guess we got to go, but we get to see them next week. Yes, we see will you see you all next week.